Hey guys, welcome to 1159 Videos. How many times do you guys get headlights and it has water in there and you keep busting your headlights out or you keep busting if your uh, turn signal's in there? Well, and you're going, well how the heck is water getting in there? There's no, there's no cracks in it anywhere. What the heck's going on? Well, if you were to look, what's going on is right about where your hood would line up water drips back up on top of this or it comes in down off the hood and by your fender and drops on top of the headlight now let me show you what's going on inside of that area once it rains now what's going on is how to get a better angle from back here say right here you can see the glue and then right about here you see nothing okay well further up under here it's the same way there's a little bit missing so here's a simple fix on this and here's another little spot right here where you can see it seems to be lacking glue well what's probably you had a cold day a super hot day and it's just enough to pop it free from the uh, glue that's holding it together to seal it so here's a quick and easy fix voila silicone clear silicone and all you're going to do is pretty much right here and you're just going to reseal this bad boy all the way down you know, try not to get none on the front of it just keep this where it's out of sight under the hood and type thing come all the way back down now all that is resealed and you really got to hit the top areas because that's where the water would sit. Water's not going to climb in on the sides. Water's not going to climb in on the from the bottom up. It's going to be coming in from up here. So and right where we saw it was clearly open. I just made sure it got a little bit extra on there. And boom, that's done. Now, don't forget, you have water in the headlights. So you're literally going to have to pull out, come back in here. And let's see, as you see the plug right there, pull the plug out, pull the headlight out, and hair dryer. Make sure you come in from the back side. Now look, some of these are pretty easy to pull out, so you just go ahead and pull the headlight out, take the blow dryer to it, get all the extra uh, moisture out of the headlight, put your headlight back in, because otherwise if you seal it up here and you have moisture in here, well, there's an O-ring up on the back of the headlight where it goes into it. So that's going to seal all the moisture in there and still cause problems. So just, you know, take an extra couple minutes, blow dry it out, and then you'll be good as new. That way you don't have to go buy a new headlight. Problem solved. Hope that helps you guys. Catch you on the next one. Stop back in, and we are going to be doing a headlight comparison on these plastic uh, headlights. You see them, they're all faded. and. They, you're like, man, my headlights look so bad, the truck looks good, but the headlights are horrible. I don't want to go buy new ones. Well, we're going to do a comparison of a whole bunch of different buffing compounds and headlight restorers and all these ones that say they're going to make them look brand new again. We're going to find out which one works and the best method to do it. So check back for that video, and I'll catch you on the next one. 1159 Videos, out.